Hello and welcome. My name is Raven. Thanks for watching my channel. Today I'm going to do a love reading for the earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. So let's just see what is going on with your love life earth signs. So we got the high priestess. Someone has stepped into their power and uncovered knowledge. Also, too, with this car, this is for someone very specific. I'm seeing something about a sorority or a fraternity. I see Greek letters on here. So some of you guys might be connecting with a close group of people, or it could be actually like your frat brothers or your sorority sisters. Okay, yeah, there's some secrets that have been revealed. Yeah, and also, too, what I'm getting from this book, some of you guys may have found some information out about your person. Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, some of you guys may have found out that this person was not single. Nine of Swords in reverse. Yeah, it's almost like this... It's almost like this knowledge was already known, but it's being confirmed for a few of you guys. Six of Swords, okay, so this person is trying to communicate and come back in. So I feel like, okay, what I'm getting here is that for Earth Signs, I feel like you guys have recently discovered some key knowledge about your person that may have been hidden. Um, I'm getting for some of you guys, it may have been that your person was not actually single. Um, I'm also getting the knowledge is that uh, this person may have released whoever that person was. So maybe the, the secret was they weren't single, but now they actually are. Yeah, with the judgment. Yep, and on this judgment card, there's two women and there's one man. Okay, so yeah, somebody from the past is, is going to be coming in and communicating with the Six of Swords and the Eight of Wands. And it looks like you guys are <laughs> intuitive or somehow you know with the High Priestess card. Okay. Also, too, um, remember when I was talking about sororities and fraternities, um, I think also there are somebody's going to be finding out that their person is like a part of something like some type of cult or like organization or like into something that's like kind of, I don't know. Yeah. Something that's like specific um, and niche. Yeah, it could be something just kind of dark. Look at this, the magician in, the re in reverse. Um, this, earth signs, yeah. Y'all may be finding out that your person was manipulative or lying a lot <laughs> with the magician in the reverse or into it, maybe even into some type of... Um, yeah, dark kind of stuff on the low low. Yes, the star. Yeah, okay. So, Earth signs, your person, your person isn't happy right now and they feel weak with the star in reverse and the strength. Something's going on with your person. You, f you figured out, maybe that's why you figured out. Um, the truth about something so now this person realizes they don't have power yeah they don't have they that's what I'm hearing they don't have power with the strength in reverse and they didn't really get what they wanted I think that's what's happening the high priestess is seeing all of this stuff yeah this is two this is two different characters the high priestess this is probably somebody that's a it could be a divine feminine or a twin flame or a high vibrational person that's spiritual. And then we have the, the magician in reverse. So this high priestess is seeing the darkness and the truth. And who, whatever this person is going through, I think um, 
yeah they're not they're not happy and then they're the wheel of fortune in reverse they're um having bad luck or not really yeah i'm seeing a pink flower in the middle there's something going on this um jeesh i hear spirits talking very loudly um The the part this person has um like wounded feminine energy. So if it's a masculine person, their feminine energy is wounded. And spirit is trying to realign it, but they're resisting uh healing. Yeah, two of swords. <laughs> Two of Swords. This person is blind. Yeah, they're not Two of Swords. They're kind of blinded. Six of Cups in reverse. Yeah, they're stuck in the past. All right, so Earth Signs, y'all person energy is is um coming through in a very interesting way. It's not, it's not really, I don't know. It's, it's more like an energy reading of your person. That's kind of what I'm picking up. So your person is resisting healing and change because they are stuck in the past. Six of Cups, Two of Swords, they are stuck. They can't see a lot of things because of something in the past. They are blinded because of something in the past. The old relationship, something that went south. Yeah, Two of Swords, Two of Wands. Two, two different options or... Just old stuff, almost like an old life that needs to be released. Let's see, what else? Okay, the Kipper. All right, so what else is going on for Earth Signs? Oh, Pathway. Okay, Pathway. Oh, Judication. And then Bad Health. I'm hearing judgments here. That's what I just heard. Judgments here. Didn't I pull the did I pull the judgment card? Oh I did. Yeah, I pulled the judgment card earlier. Okay. Yeah, and I heard judgments here. So I feel like um yeah, bad health, strength in reverse. <clears throat> so um earth signs, your person may not my throat too. I feel like your person may not I don't know, it's maybe trying to figure out what to say, like clearing their throat, trying to figure out what to say, or they might be stressing about what to say. They might be stressing because um, the truth has been revealed in judgment, judgments here. And a new path, a new path is opening up. Let's see, let's clarify these cards, Spirit. What's this? Let's clarify what's the bad health. Why is the bad health here? And the strength card in reverse. Ooh. Five of Pentacles. <laughs> Five of Pentacles. Somebody got left out in the cold. And then we have the King of Swords. Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay. <laughs> my green candle just fell over. Yeah, I feel like somebody is mad. Somebody wants to speak. King of Swords. They're they're upset because maybe they're um they're not able to speak their truth. So they want to come forward and speak the truth about something. And that green candle that fell means like speaking from the heart, that heart chakra energy. Wow. Maybe, yeah, maybe also too, that's the bad health like stress stress you know stress is is very um you know it can weigh on your heart so stop stressing y'all gonna have y'all chance to talk whoever this person is wants a chance to talk yeah six of pentacles so now um this person wants to wants to talk about collaboration communication Six of Swords, Six of Pentacles. This is probably somebody from the past, but it just seems like it's a lot going on. All right, let's see. What else? Spirit, why is the... um? Let's clarify why the Judication card is here. Why is the Judication card here? 
I heard judgments here, and then I see it as a new pathway, but let's clarify. What is this in the background? Yeah, huh? I really see some of you guys have a person that's affiliated with some type of, uh, yeah, some type of affiliation. I don't know how to say it, <laughs> like organization, affiliation, they got something going on, but it looks like it's a positive one. Okay, we got the victory card. So somebody might be winning. I keep seeing mad stuff about court. Thief, yeah. Country home. Loss of money, yikes. Okay, so when I asked to clarify the adjudication card, I got the thief and the loss of money. Um, and I got victory. So some of your uh, counterparts might be going through some type of um, battle or something going on with some money, but they're going to win. And then I see the country house. So, yeah. After <laughs> this is this is similar. I don't know which reading it, this this was, but this was this is similar to I feel like one of the readings I just did. Um, it looks like, yeah, there's some type of, um, issue going on, but it looks like your person is going to come out of it successful. So, all right, somebody from the past, all these past people, I need to, I'm about to do a reading like, can we, is there any new, I'm about to. I'm about to do a separate reading about new people because it's all, it seems like everybody got somebody from the past coming back in. All right, Sphere, what else do Earth signs need to know about their love life? Yeah, um, Earth signs, you, I think wh whatever you've seen with the High Priestess card that we started off with, it's, it looks like you're no longer investing. It looks like you were maybe you were investing and you realized it wasn't a good investment with the Seven of Pentacles, but now it's in reverse. So upright, this person is holding two Pentacles and there's five in the ground, but they only have two in their hand now. This came up in reverse. So it looks like Earth signs, you're no longer making bad investments. That's what I'm seeing. And you're releasing yourself from burdens and things that no longer serve you in healing. Uh, probably because of this information that you see about the about this person. Uh, but this person looks like they're coming back in. <laughs> and they're mad. But they're going to speak from the heart. So this should be, this should be pretty good. Alright, Spirit. What is this person going to say? What is this person going to say? Three of Cups. Um, okay. Five of Cups in reverse. Hmm. I think they're, they may actually talk about the truth about a, <clears throat> a third party. Yeah, and as I'm trying to talk, my throat is like, yeah. There may have been something that happened in the past regarding a third party or it could have been, um, if it wasn't a third party, it could have been like a specific incident. Like, oh, remember that one night? Remember that one time this happened? And, but it wasn't really fully um, clarified. Yeah, it's like the truth about a third party. Why somebody was holding on to a third party. Yep. Queen of Pentacles, Five of Swords. Yeah, it, the third party could have been a business partner, um, an ex-wife or ex or something in, of that nature. Yeah, and, and whoever this person was didn't have good energy. So it looks like this person uh, may be trying to explain the truth about a third party. And why? And this person felt trapped or something. This person felt trapped. Yeah, this Queen of Pentacles um, had some type of hold. What else is this person going to reveal? Oh, 
Oh, a lot of cards. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Hoo -hoo. So, all right, Earth signs. Yeah, this. This is a lot. I don't know what's going on with y'all person, but it, it just, I'm seeing the hermit card. So this, this might be you. Yeah. I, I feel like this is you, Earth Signs, the hermit card. Like you might need to take some time to process this information. Okay. So you might want to take some time to process this information by yourself it looks like you're in high priestess mode in hermit mode taking your time going within finding out the truth because whatever is going on with this person it looks like this person has not been telling the truth with the prince of swords in reverse maybe lying about petty stuff just lying the devil yeah and this person has some unhealthy attachments yeah, this person definitely has some unhealthy attachments or some unhealthy habits. The Seven of Swords. So this person may have walked away from you in the past. And this person may have said things or done things that were really treacherous in the past with the Ten of Swords. So a lot of swords, devil energy. So I feel like Earth Signs, the person that you are um, inquiring about or that that may be either on your mind or they're thinking about you perhaps, or maybe both of you guys are thinking about each other perhaps. This person has a lot of um, healing that needs to be done. There's a lot of darkness here. It looks like they're going through some type of um, conflict. Could be an actual legal battle or just conflict with another party. Um, but really, it looks like there's just a lot going on. Um, that's what I'm picking up. It looks like I'm just picking up this person's energy. Uh, let me see what else Spirit wants to tell us for Earth Signs. Okay. All right. So we got leaving space. So this person needs time to heal and you need time to heal. So you guys might be um, taking some time to heal and work on yourself. So if you're doing that, continue doing that. I did see Hermit Mo, so this is kind of going along with that same energy. Hermit energy, leaving space, um, looking at things from a higher perspective. Then we see Cupid's arrow, have faith, love is coming, surprise, invitation, or meeting, hesitation. So you guys might get uh, an invitation from this person, uh, but you're going to be surprised and a little hesitant because of some of the stuff that you're seeing and observing. Uh, Spirit is saying that, you know, this person, I feel like you have unconditional love for this person, but you're also right now focusing on self-love, which is awesome. Um, I'm seeing oneness for me is like at some point I'm the union will come, but I feel like spirit uh, yeah, spirit said, What do you want? Thank you. I heard what do you want? Think about what you really want. You can have union, but think about what you really want in your union with the deal breakers card. It says list and adhere to your deal breakers. The universe will support you staying true to you so there's unconditional love which is great but you know there's still some things that need to be identified as deal breakers so what are those deal breakers i feel like union is is possible but i feel like i right now i don't know this is not how i expected this reading to go i'm feeling just a little bit of like a uh just i don't know like a Kind of like a hidden darkness. That's what I'm picking up, Earth Signs, for your person. But um, this person's going to tell you the truth about a third party and why they were holding on. And, you know, this final battery that I said battery. Hmm. That's interesting. This final battle that's going to lead to victory um, should clear out some energy. But, yeah, it looks like this person is stressed. 
But this person is not really open to healing. That's what I'm picking up. Or they, they still have a lot of healing to do. Also, to this group that they're joining, it, it could be like a therapy or like a rehab or something, too. I'm pick yeah. Okay, five of wands. Yeah, this person is in a lot of conflict. What I'm even picking up on this card is like a conflict within themselves, even, you know, like it's like they really be battling themselves, different versions of themselves. Some of them might even have like, um, I don't know how to say it. Um, okay, I'm gonna, actually, I'm going to just leave that alone. Yeah, okay. So they're, they're battling a person from the past. Definitely a counterpart from the past. Four of Wands in reverse. It could be an ex-wife or somebody that they were married to. Somebody they used to live with. Queen of Swords. So they're, they're battling someone... Five of Wands, <laughs> Four of Wands in Reverse, Queen of Swords. Yeah, they're battling somebody from the past that could have, could have been an ex-partner, ex-wife, um, somebody they had a home or children with. Yeah. I don't like this, this person, this Queen of, and I'm a Queen of Swords too, that's my archetype, but. This one over here as I'm reading this card. Her vibe is a little weird. She look like she up to no good. Yeah, so he so your person is overcoming heartbreak. Yeah, and and juggling some type of, you know, major connection. I'm hearing soulmate connection. Thank you, spirit. This this was like a karmic soulmate. Three of three of swords in reverse and the two of pentacles. So they're overcoming heartbreak and overcoming um, being back and forth. Two of Pentacles. They're coming out of that energy from the past. Yeah, but it looks like whatever it was, it, it could have literally been causing stress. Or just, you know, just negative energy. Queen of Cups in reverse. Yeah, this person, this person does not have their best interest at heart. Your your person's past partner. So, yeah, Earth signs, the Moon in reverse. Yeah, and the Magician. Yeah, they found out that this person was manipulative. Yeah, and they're releasing it. Yep. The Empress, Death, Princess of Swords. Yeah, this for for some of you guys, your person has a, a what the hell? Oh, sorry, the car is falling, y'all. Y'all person has um somebody that they used to have a family with or something, and now they're separating from this person and it's ending. It could be a, a ex girlfriend ex-wife or somebody that they've been with for a long time in high school or since college or something of that nature somebody that's been around for a while yeah so i guess earth signs that's what's going on with y'all person um Let's see, what else? What's the last thing, Spirit? Does this sound like we just like picking up on energy of counterparts? Let's see. <laughs> the Deal Breakers card came out again. Yeah. This is a time of deciding what you really want. Leaving space, the same cards. Okay, yeah. So, Earth Signs, it sounds like y'all might have somebody that's on your mind. But it looks like you're picking up on a lot of truth. So you have to decide. Ooh, look at all this. Yeah, all right. I'm After this, I'm going to wrap it up because it's a lot. So we still got the unconditional love. So we know that that's there. That's awesome. We got the boat. Spirit is saying you're going to receive what you need. There's going to be progress. 
you're going to either be moving on or you're going to be providing closure within this connection. It could be a little bit of both. So you can be moving on to something else or you could be having closure within it. Okay, yeah, I see the puppet master. So some of you guys are dealing with the narcissist. Um, pulling your strings, narcissist, manipulation, control. We have relational abuse. So that can come in a lot of different ways. We also have talking. So you guys might want to be um, talking to this person again, but it looks like that might be, I don't know, maybe later with the leaving space. This person is looking at your photographs, thinking about you. And yeah, love is coming in, but it looks like um, we have the siren here. So I feel like earth signs, you might want to focus on yourself and be in your own siren energy. Um, be enticing. Be, you know, happy, free, walking your power and all that good stuff. So, yeah, but I don't know. This is not what I was expecting. I'm picking up some heavy energy with the person that you guys may be thinking about um, or signs. All right. If you want a personal, um, you can check the description box. Thanks for watching the Black Pearl channel. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.